<clears throat> All set? We're rolling. Okay. Hey folks, this is Ryan from ORS Cross Country Skis Direct in Onion River Sports. Today we are at Trap Family Lodge in Stowe, Vermont, and we are demoing uh, some Fisher skis and also the new Turnamic binding system that was co-developed by Fisher and Rosignol. We're actually at the cabin. If you've ever been to uh, Trap Family Lodge, you'll recognize this cabin. And uh, the reason why I point that out um, is it allowed us to really highlight one of the features of the Turnamic binding, which is its tunability. So the cabin is quite a bit uphill <laughs> from the uh, base area. Um, I'm not sure what the total vertical is, but it's, it's a lot. So it was about a 40 minute climb uphill. And um, one of the features of the Turnamic binding system is its tunability. What I'm talking about is its ability to reposition on the ski. So right now it's mounted with the uh, pin line or, or the, the bar line at the balance point of the ski, which is neutral. That's going to give you the optimum combination of grip and glide. If you want better grip, you can move the binding forward three positions, and you do it without any tools needed by sliding this little plastic uh, piece back, and then the binding is free to move into the three forward positions. You probably can't see real well, but there's a little window right there. That says zero. You can go to plus... Um, I'm sorry. Oh, here we go. Uh, zero, okay, it's down here now. Plus one, plus two, and plus three. So right now at plus three, I've moved it into the forwardmost position, and that's going to give me the best grip. And it really made a difference coming up this hill for 40 minutes, I'll tell you that. Now, if you're on a flat pack surface, you're going to want to probably put it more in the neutral position, or if you find that the skis are dragging a little bit when you're kicking and gliding, you can actually move it back behind the balance point and that will give you better glide so you can go all the way to minus three so it has seven different positions to uh, tune the performance of the ski and it's all done without tools and the binding can come right off the IFP plate without a tool as well. Turnamic is named uh, Turnamic because of the uh, fact that this part of the binding turns that's what opens up the clamp um, and closes the clamp to engage the boot there are four different binding models, and some of them have actually a step-in feature, and you can tell by the notch that is located in the toe. So this particular race model, you can actually step down into the binding, and it works sort of like an automatic step-in style, just like that. And then to release, you, either, you can turn that with your hand, or you can use your ski pole tip. It fits right into the groove. Um, and it turns just like that, so you don't need to bend over if, uh, you know, if that is easier for you. So that's where the turn and turnamic comes from. Now the dynamic part of this binding system is the fact that the heel piece is connected to the toe piece, which is nice when you do reposition um, the toe piece, the heel moves with it, so you don't also have to reposition the heel. But it's mounted, it kind of, the, the heel piece floats on this track, so it really enables the ski to um, to flex naturally. Like, in other words, the binding doesn't uh, inhibit the flex of the ski in any way. Um, so it, it really gives you the true performance of the ski um, by the fact that the binding kind of floats on top of it. A few more things about uh, Turnamic. Um, you'll notice it looks pretty familiar uh, if you're a Nordic person. Two ridges. So it is cross compatible with NNN boots and also ProLink by Solomon. Um, the plate, however, is proprietary. The plate that's mounted on Fisher and Rosignol skis um, only accepts the Turnamic binding. Uh, NIS bindings do not work, and vice versa. Um, so, anyway, that's it. Brand new this year, uh, ready for fall of uh, 2017, the Turnamic binding. And finally, about that, uh, it now allows Fisher and Rosignol um, to have um, their own boot sole. So they have now building their boots on top of the Turnamic boot sole and uh, that gives them a lot more um, flexibility with fit and so it's, a, it's a definitely a good step forward in the Nordic world. So that's it and uh, thanks for, for hanging out with us up here on this beautiful day. Uh, once again I'm Ryan from ORS Cross Country Skis Direct and from Onion River Sports. Have a good one. Thanks.